Well, there's a lot of awareness now uh, on the rise about something called endocrine disrupting chemicals. And the endocrine system, it's uh, really integral to our lives as humans. Uh, the hormonal system, estrogen, testosterone, these are some of the more well-known hormones that are in our bodies. Uh, so these hormones are our body's communication system. An endocrine disruptor is a chemical that interferes with that communication of hormones, if you will, uh, by perhaps mimicking certain hormones. Like in the case of parabens, parabens are a weak estrogen mimic, meaning to your body they look a little bit like estrogen. BPA is also a very well-known endocrine disrupting chemical. Certain flame retardants and phthalates are also endocrine disrupting chemicals. And uh, a great study, uh, great as in very thorough, came out last year from the United Nations Environment Program and the World Health Organization looking at endocrine disruptors chemicals, the state of the science, what we do know, what we don't know, and they raised the concern that there's a possibility that the presence of these chemicals in many products could be linked to the rise in certain uh, certain cancers that are linked to the hormonal system. So uh, thyroid cancer is on the rise, especially in young women under the age of 40. It's rising quite uh, rapidly uh, in this population. Also uh, cancers of the breast and uh, male reproductive system. Some of these cancers are on the rise and uh, scientists have been looking for an explanation. This report suggests that there may be a link there. So based on the precautionary principle, we should be doing what we can to reduce exposure to these chemicals. Mm -hmm.